Oh boy, the Minecraft movie. Yeah, um, I've watched the trailer. And if you guys haven't, go watch it because you're gonna need to for this video. Let's just get right into my thoughts on this. I think it is genuinely one of the first things, one of the first video game movies that I've never seen disrespect its source material so much with hyper-realistic models, shitty jokes, because it does not respect the source material, which is the key issue with the Minecraft movie. It does not respect the source material one bit. The thing is, I don't believe Jared Hess has had any idea of what the Minecraft movie, or what Minecraft at all is. And because, um, you know how I, can, how I can tell that? From just the style of the trailer. I'm 99% sure this guy just looked up a bunch of reference images and then to Warner Brothers and was like, hey, you know what, let's do this shit. And then they made a movie out of it and it came out looking as that disaster piece. And don't even get me started on that one scene. I'm sorry, but this movie trailer is god awful. The only good part of this- there's a moth on my microphone. The- oh! Get on my- They're all, the only- I think the only good part about this was the piglins. The piglins were one of the only good parts of this entire trailer. Because they actually looked good. They looked like as they looked close to the source material, while the Minecraft sheep just looked fucking cursed. And that's just like... The llama as well? I just- I don't know, this entire movie... I don't know. It just rubs me the wrong way. And one of my biggest issues with this movie is that... <sighs> They use a mix of CGI and live action, which initially, you know, that wouldn't be a bad thing. But the thing is, Minecraft is a very blocky world. And having just real life actors slapped into them, I just don't really think it works. Because, you know, Minecraft's blocky. It's like if you were to, you know, take a screenshot of your Minecraft world and you were to Photoshop yourself into it, it would obviously look off. And one thing I would have preferred that they'd done is first having the first part of the movie being live action and then having the second part of the movie be animated like the the second they go through the portal for example the portal to minecraft because i know they're gonna do that then they turn blocky and into minecraft skins i think that's a way better idea than whatever the hell they have going on right now with fucking jack black being minecraft steve i'm sorry but there is n i cannot get behind that i cannot see jack black as steve he is just like he's so iconic you just kind of can't really associate him with anyone else than himself i just think this movie would have honestly been better being animated as that would also solve the Steve problem. This is, um, for example, go check out Illumio's remake. This is exactly what I would have wanted the Minecraft movie to be. Because it stays true to its art style, and also just has better facial animations. I think it would have honestly caused more confusion for the characters if they just walked in and they turn into blocky characters, and I think that would have also worked really well for the trailer. And... You know, once again, I just don't think this movie exactly respected source material because it's made by Warner Brothers and Jared Hess. And they, as far as I know, are not Minecraft superfans. Now, why am I bringing this up, you ask? Because the Sonic movie. Now, I personally have never watched the Sonic movie, but it is for all ages and it's genuinely well made and it respects the source material and the creators of it are superfans of Sonic. And I think that's why the movie was so good. One of the reasons why the movie was so good, because they actually liked the source material. But this movie, it just feels so corporate and Hollywoodified. I don't know about you, but I just... I don't know, I can't get used to this movie. It's like they just looked up a few reference images of what Minecraft is, and then they called it a day, put it in the movie. That's exactly why I just think this kind of fell flat, if I'm not gonna lie, and probably is going to fall flat. Maybe it's gonna be so absurdly bad that we can laugh at it, which I actually hope that'll be the case. That we don't instead just sit in disappointment looking at what, what uh, fucking Warner Brothers has done to the concept of Minecraft. I hope we can at least laugh about it. So yeah, that is my thoughts on this. I think the Minecraft movie is going to be a train wreck. I at least hope we can laugh at it. And I have hope for the Minecraft Netflix series. I don't really know what else to say, so see ya.